Sure, why not? Let us go. Now we play a Sub Zero. Sub Zero's soul depends on it. And I call this a, a swan. <laughs> Not a very elegant swan, my oh, you. Oh, look, it's Cyrax. I'll be damned. They roboticized Colonel Mustard. <laughs> LK44? Jesus Christ, why don't I just call you R2-D2? Come on, man. And welcome to the Solnado, which has grown a few snakes since I've last been here. That was pretty cool. Is that what the snake was called in Mortal Kombat 3? I think so, yeah, Solnado. Or at least another realm pets, I don't give a shit. Uh. Wink, wink, chop. Uh. That's roughly 40% of my gameplay. You're better at this than me, Elliot. I will give you that. So I practice with green. <laughs> I, I was always a fan of Cyrax's teleportation, where he pretty much just explodes into millions of pieces <laughs> just to reassemble into wait, another area. Wait, did we actually have a Cyrax action figure? Did you guys? Elliot did him one time, yeah. He just slapped the cyborg. Couldn't explode into different pieces. <laughs> Until that time, Elliot put it in the microwave, but it didn't reassemble. <laughs> <laughs> Boink! Hey, bro, you know what would be really That's hilarious? Actually, I do remember that. I do remember that Cyrax. So I, uh, yeah. Because I would, I, I would like, I would, one time I randomly, like, I drop kick Marky in the stomach, <laughs> and then I performed a friendship saying, buy a Cyrax doll. <laughs> Right. And now we were, and that next time we, so that explains it. He knocked you out out of anger that day. You know, it'd be really funny if any time you like hit the Cyrax dolls, they made the same effect sound effect in Streets of Rage 2. Bonk! <laughs> Grandpa! <laughs> That's a good way to end this match. I wasn't aware I had. L I still. I can imagine Cyrax being like, I wasn't aware I still had a kidney. <laughs> I will face the Lin Kuei when my task is done, not before. Go back to your Linux, bitch. Wait, are you naked? <laughs> stronger now they're gone. I. How'd you guys find your way here? Sub Zero. But you're dead. Thanks. <laughs> not the Sub Zero you speak of. He was my brother. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> only here oh wow. It's always the brother, isn't it? Uh oh. Okay, okay, I'm recording. That's still good. Oh, thank god, thank god, thank god. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. Oh, Coliseum. Wait. Damn it, every RPG sent you right to a Coliseum. You have disturbed our regeneration. Oh, god. I was just defending myself. Oh, god, it's Ermac. Gotcha. No shit. That was not the MK2 gotcha sound effect. Resistance is futile. Check out what I can do with my own. You will not pay. Up, 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 Armac tends to give me shit in the gameplays too because I always have bad timing when I'm fighting him. What do you mean? Like in what sense? In other words, anytime he does a special attack, I'm completely caught off guard by most of the te telekinetic shit. Like that? So that, the levitation, the teleport punch, the falcon punch, but... <laughs> Meanwhile, he's just bitch smacking a thousand people right there. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna have to slap the 35 hose in you, bitch. <laughs> like, 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 you punch him in the face, do you hear like 36 owls simultaneously? You probably would, too. Oh! That's what you get for trying to do some goofy arm shit in the middle of the fight, Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> Only he can do the goofy arm shit. Oh, that was close. That was nice. I got no idea, but I'll take that. He just moved his head two inches to the left. Oh. Like I said, that shit can catch you at the worst times. Yeah, they could. Round two. Fight. That's a very revealing shot of you, Johnny. <laughs> you like eating they do. Yes. Come on, get over here. You're not Scorpion. I keep forgetting. How? Oh, they're yellow and blue, Elliot. Well, that's a bad <laughs> mistake to make, dude. <laughs> that's a nice pose. I could have sworn I flown above that fireball. But... That's a nice pose, though. You know, I would like. Ah! Boink! Ah! 
Use the sword, oh. not the punch. Use the forks. So zero prob you know, I thought you sub zero probably saves like a shitload on utensil utensils. Ice fork? Ice spoon. <laughs> The food ends up cold in about 10 minutes, but, you know. I can't eat soup, though. It melts right away. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. That's that jerk-off shit you see out of tournament play. <laughs> jerk-off shit because oh, they that actually, was close. They actually practice. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I call it jerk-off shit because I suck. <laughs> What was that point of that fireball? It didn't even look like it hit you. It was just like, hey, check out what I can do. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Grab the ball! No. Punch God for cheesecake! <laughs> Punch God for cheesecake? <laughs> That's random as all hell, okay? We apologize to the Christian community out there. <laughs> no, you're talking about right. Oh. Uh. Sorry, wait. I like that. Go for the what the hell are you dumb hoes doing, bitch? Aw, oh, come oh, on! For God's sake. How dare you block my attack? <laughs> How dare you devise a good way to end this part? Then again, depending on what part this Oh my god! That's pretty much what my gameplay was like. Fuck you, throw. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it's getting intense. <laughs> oh! Damn! That's damn! Balls. Damn! And bitch slapping. He hits bitch slapping. <laughs> All right, that's beautiful, Elliot. Blade to command. Sonya Blade to command. Do you read? No. Sonya Blade. Damn, they can't hear me. <laughs> Is he dead? Wait, wait, wait! If we say no, she won't. We Maybe she'll think she can't. Possible. We can't hear. I must go to the Coliseum. That's but me. I need your help to get it is a portal to the south. You can use it to transport yourselves back to Earth. Weren't you supposed to be chained up, Sonya? That portal better be Mother Alright, this game's ready to end for mature. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, nameless person, which means you're automatically gonna lose. <laughs> Wait, you can see Montaro. Montaro? Yeah. The centaur. Who is Montaro. that chick? Who is that purple chick? I have no idea. Maybe that was Lee May or something. Maybe? Why do people want to die in this game? <laughs> you must kill me. Uh oh! Conveniently placed flashback! Yeah. Bitch, kill him or I kill you! Nobody ever performs a fatality in this tournament! Bing! Now he's chicken. I'm gonna have to teach you some discipline. <laughs> so what happened to the guy? <laughs> oh. Whoa. He is now Goro food. At least as far as I'm gonna see into this. You will bring him before me. No one makes demands of the Emperor. Reptile! Oh man, I'm still recovering. <laughs> God damn it, so what why ain't we been standing next to him if that's all he does? <laughs> you know, Reptile has no dialogue whatsoever. He's a snake, what does he need to say? Uh, look to the Luna? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Reptile. Turn on to clue warp temperature. Turn off include dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> and cold. He hates the cold. I forgot about that, Red Reptiles. Why do you Actually, do that? You know what? Uh, <laughs> I'm more distracted by the two guys trying to fight that big ass <laughs> beast in the background. That's, a, that's an obelisk. That's an obelisk? I like obelisk or giant stone pillars. That is nothing like an obelisk. <laughs> that's, apparently that's what it is. That's what they're calling it? Obelisk? I'm grateful Shao Kahn didn't send that fucking thing out of it. That could have been one of the really asshole challenges in the challenge tower, though. Yeah, that would. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while since I played. You, you can keep your x-ray meter. You can keep it full as long as you want. It's just yeah. when you use it, it goes down. Okay, in that case, Elliot, uh, when you get an x-ray meter, if, if your opponent's close to death anyway, I would just save it for the second round. <laughs> you missed. You missed, too. Aw. How, how do you block that? I don't know. It's Mortal Kombat. We can't question it. Yeah, we can. That's the whole point of Let's Play Commentary, I think. 
Oh, you got hit. <laughs> I know. You're having some bad luck with that evasion there, Elliot. I also notice you're sliding a lot more. Do you just remember how to do the move? Yeah. Nah. Oh! I could, oh, pancreas! I wonder what you have to do to get disqualified from Mortal Kombat when you think about it. Blood! <laughs> you almost got him, Elliot. And he's almost got you. This is tense. Oh! oh. Wait, wait, we're still on the, it's not on yeah, the third, round, third round, so... Yeah, we're still on the clock. Fight. Okay, I won't accuse you of badly what missing again. What the audience is throwing on the, on the arena? I don't know. Uh, I imagine beer bottles, but it's like it dis looks like skulls, disembodied heads. Jesus Christ, these people want to give their all to the show. I didn't think that's what they had in mind. And still, those two bald guys are fighting that big ass <laughs> beast in the background. They don't seem to be going anywhere though. They seem to be holding themselves off pretty damn well too, actually. That one they're just standing there. They're not even advancing at the beast. Sorry, Elliot, but that's way more interesting than your fight. <laughs> oh, he won. <laughs> I would kill you, but that is not my purpose here. My purpose is this to is find the, the you know, this, this is the most ethical I've ever seen of all our Mortal combatants so far. Wait, why is Goro there? I asked that earlier. My brother participated in this folly. Folly? Okay, so here's another question. Is the guy in the grace is obviously not smoke at this point. Is that the male version of Chameleon? Yeah. Probably. That's my that's the thumb up my ass, guess. Bring him out here. Oh, oh that felt good. I'm sub zero to second. <laughs> they call me sub zero two. I'm more smug than my brother. Did they get the same voice actor for MK vs. DC US yeah, Scorpion? It's most like, it, I, some, some show to, yeah, you're right. And this is the most iconic rivalry ever. Fought in front of Shao Kahn. He knows how to pick his fights. <laughs> and those two are still going at it in the background. There's no oh, way that's to a it. huge ass monster. It's gonna take him some time. <laughs> but they're not even advancing towards the damn thing. You would advance toward that. Well the, the, well, the monster's not even doing any his job, job. He's not doing a no, job any better either. Well, the monster doesn't want to get stabbed by the spears, but at the same time, they don't want to advance toward the monster because, for God's sake, look at it. <laughs> See, that alone would make me ship bricks. Elliot, your fight is really boring. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Smack a bitch, kick him in his gut. Good, he fell. Now I can see the beast go at it. <laughs> <laughs> You guys suck. Nah, you no, we're not saying you suck, Ellie. We're just saying we've seen the fight already before. I, I really want to just see what's going on in the background. You'll see more when we get to the city. Hot down, somewhere in the city. Oh, look, he actually swung at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's shackled. Is that why he's not moving? Yeah. <laughs> By no, 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 there's no shack, uh, he's shackled, he's shackled no by chains. the feet. Oh my oh, god. No, 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 he just, you know, he's just wearing shackles. So. No, no, he's not chained anything. Yeah, yeah, oh, okay, that's what I was saying earlier. Oh yeah, Elliot won. I'm sorry, Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, when you say approximation, how much longer we got before we should really, like, at the end of this chapter? Well, it is the end right. of this chapter, yeah. actually. Uh-oh. Oh, great. Who Ketchup and mustard. <laughs> <laughs> Those are our conceptual names, and we wish to forget them. <laughs> Wait, I just, I just realized this. What? Sector and Cyrax are like ketchup and mustard. <laughs> that's that's the joke. <laughs> They're conceptual names for ketchup and mustard. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Just like Tundra was for Sub-Zero. I wonder what the hell Smoke's concept name must have been. Uh, Carcinogens. <laughs> what was it? Carcinogen. <laughs> I thought it would have been, um, Frankenberry. Okay. <laughs> So instead of smoke getting the cyborg treatment, it's Sub Zero. Son of a bitch! Well, that was weird. <laughs> Katana, what the fuck did I just see? How is it that Earthrealm ninjas brazenly appear before me when well, they are ninjas? <laughs> Highly visible ninjas, but ninjas not. I am one per. I am one woman, Shao Kahn. What the fuck you want me to do? <laughs> Not to be misogynist, but it is one woman against a shitload of ninjas. Who's the purple chick? Probably Lee May. 
if it can be uprooted altogether. Or random tramp number three. <laughs> Jeez. What's one? What's sure. one and two? One was the girl in the Shao Kahn's victory pose. Two is the one that's tied up there. You might know her, Scarlet. It was Scarlet. I'm not smug anymore. <laughs> Just sad. <laughs> Chapter nine, Katana. How you show your All right. Katana, I follow Let's uh you. take a break. Let's alone. take a break after this cutscene. Let's see what's going on here me? first. All right. I will not be scolded like some child. Uh oh. You Falling need to out. Be careful. I have never seen your father this angry with you. you uh, know, girls having their girl talk. He expects more from you than jiggly, jiggly, jiggly. <laughs> Oh, I see. So you pressed low kick on all those battles, didn't you, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Clever girl. Princess Katana. You would think Johnny Cage would bat an eye to that. Like that was so cool. <laughs> hey, listen, honey. We don't want to fight. But we will. Ow. We must. You will learn respect. Smoke is just bad with ladies. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna take a break here. We'll be right we'll be back right after back. these messages.